Welcome back everyone! Today I have some exciting news to share with you. Nuostems, the software for stem separation and audio processing, has just released its latest version, Nuostems version 3. In this video, I'll walk you through all the incredible new features and improvements that make version 3 the best choice for both tractor and non-tractor DJs. So let's dive right in! For those who don't know what Nuostems is, it's the software for converting any of your existing tracks, which might be in MP3, Wave or other formats, to Stems for Tractor Pro. Stems is a special file format for Tractor that allows you to control your drums, bass, melody and vocals using controller, MIDI mapping or your mouse. Nuostems V3 also introduces an option to convert your tracks to instrumentals and acapellas for usage in Serato, Rekordbox and other software. More on this later in the video. To start using Nuostems, the easiest way is to just drag and drop your tracks onto the queue. Then just press the Start Processing button and see your tracks being converted to stems. Once done, you will see the stem M4A file in the output directory. To make it easier, you can click the little folder icon next to the track here. Now just import the stem file into Tractor and you're ready to go. Stem track behaves almost the same as any other track. The only difference is that now you have an ability to control your drums, bass, melody and vocals separately, in addition to your standard equalizer. Each of these have dedicated volume, filter and effect sent knobs for even more granular control if you need it. Controllers like Tractor S or Mark III or Tractor F1 work with stems out of the box. However, you are not limited just to these ones. You can MIDI map stem controls to any controller, keyboard or device, depending on your needs. Stay tuned till the end of the video for an example of what these controls do in action. The first major update in Nuostems v3 is the introduction of the brand new DMUX v4 algorithm. This cutting-edge technology, available in both high quality and balanced mode, guarantees superior audio quality, especially when it comes to separating vocals. Don't worry if you are too attached to DMUX v3 algorithm from Nuostems v2, it's still available as an option. Nuostems v3 brings a complete UI overhaul and an entirely new technology stack. The fresh and modern user interface not only enhances user experience, but also provides a solid foundation for seamless workflow. During the first launch, you can conveniently select your preferred algorithm and output folder. And don't worry, you can always change the settings later in the application settings menu. Before we start converting, though, it's best to go check our settings. In the General tab, you will find a few options that define where your stem files will be saved. If you toggle same as original output location, all your stem files will be saved right next to your original files. Here is an example. Second option is to choose a custom folder for your stems. In this case, all the stems are just saved in the specific folder and their allocation is not related to the original tracks. Third option complements the previous one. If you toggle it, your custom output folder will contain the same nested structure as the input folder that you selected. Here is an example. As you can see, the output folder recreated the structure of the input folder. This option works only if you add tracks to the queue by pressing Input Folder button over here. You will also see a warning sign next to the tracks that were added in this way, since their output location is defined by the structure of the input folder. The enhanced queue interface provides detailed information about your tracks, including artwork, artist, title, duration and file locations. Right-clicking on any track in the queue presents you with various options. You can now move the track to the top of the queue for priority processing, reset track progress to 0% if you've made changes to settings, remove a track from the queue or clear the entire queue. The edit search functionality allows you to find and manage tracks more efficiently. In the convert page, you'll always have visibility of the currently selected algorithm at the top. Moreover, the menu on the left now shows the overall conversion progress, keeping you informed throughout the process. 
The tiles provide information on benchmarks, time remaining, and the number of tracks processed. Another significant improvement in NOSAMS v3 is the inclusion of GPU acceleration support for both Mac and Windows. If you are using Windows, you'll need an NVIDIA GPU, preferably with at least 7 gigs of VRAM for optimal performance. Mac users can take advantage of this feature with Apple Silicon and AMD GPUs running macOS 12.3 or later. To make your experience even more seamless, NOSTAMS v3 features tooltips throughout the application, providing helpful hints when you hover over specific elements. NOSTAMS v3 makes it easier to manage a queue. You can now see the progress of adding tracks to the queue and have the program automatically detect your stamp files in the output directory. It gives you an option to skip adding the original tracks to the queue or overwrite and include them. Additionally, you can choose to add new tracks either to the top or the bottom of the queue. Additionally, the application now embeds the update version, allowing you to receive notifications and install updates directly from within the application. NOAS TEMS v3 offers a range of settings that are now persistent, meaning they are automatically saved and restored every time you launch the application. In the general settings, you can choose to save individual stamps as date files and enable the saving of instrumental and a cappella tracks in various formats, including WAV and MP3. If you total save as WAV, you will see this folder in your output directory once the conversion is done. You can then use these files in your DAW, for example. One of the standout features in NOSTEMS v3 is the ability to save instrumental and a cappella tracks. This functionality is perfect for DJs and music producers who use platforms like Serato, Rackedbox, and others. Similar to saving as WAVE, it creates two files in your output folder, track name with either a cappella or instrumental, appended to the end of the file name and track title. This suggests regular music files that can be added and played as ordinary tracks in your preferred software. As you can see here, I'm just drag and dropping these tracks into a record box and they are recognized right away. The advanced settings in NOSTEMS version 3 allow you to customize your software according to your needs. You can control the number of CPU cores used for stem conversion, enable or disable GPU acceleration, experiment with ALAC compression of stem files, though it's only compatible with Tractor Pro on macOS currently, and fine-tune the stamps audio processing with settings for compressor and limiter. As you know, NOS Stamps has a handy tool called Tractor Utilities. Imagine that you already have an existing Tractor collection and you want your hotcues, beat grids and metadata to be transferred to newly created stamp versions. That's exactly what Tractor Utilities do. You just need to previously import and analyze all the stem files into the collection and close Tractor. Then go back to Tractor Utilities, choose your collection file, press Transfer and wait for the process to finish. You can now open Tractor and see that hot cues, beat grids and metadata are now transferred to your stem files. The Tractor Utilities section in NOSTEMS version 3 now automatically detects the latest Tractor Pro collection file, speeding up the process. You can now track the progress of transfers and change the color of stamps separately. Speaking of later, you can change the color for each part of your stamp file. This can be done either prior to converting tracks to stamps by going to Settings and scrolling down to this section or if you already converted to stamps and want to change the colors in your tractor collection, then navigate to tractor utilities and toggle this option to apply preferred colors. These colors will be shown on your controller or in tractor software if your waveforms are set to ultraviolet, infrared or x-ray option. If set to spectrum, each stamp is shown as frequency analyzed waveform where red end of the spectrum represents low frequencies and white bluish represents high end. With version 3, NOAA Stamps takes Tractor Utilities to the next level. The new, highly accurate algorithm for transferring hot cues and beat grids eliminates drift and ensures precise results. While it might be slower than NOAA Stamps version 2, 
the increased accuracy is well worth it. The Stamps Colors preset, including custom selections, is now saved and restored upon the application restart. No Stamps V3 is a free upgrade for everyone who already bought version 2. Just install the latest V3 demo and it shall be activated right away on the same computer where you have version 2 installed. At the time of recording this video, no Stamps version 3 costs 33.99 US for lifetime perpetual license. Or, if you're inclined to the subscription model, you can subscribe to Patreon for $5 per month to get access to new stamps. As promised, here is a demonstration of using different stamp controls. This is how you can control the volume of each stamp using your mouse. As for Mark III, and F1. Or you can also just enable or disable each stem like this. F1 is the most versatile controller for controlling stamps, while S4 Mark III provides all-in-one solution. Filters are controlled like this. And effect sends are controlled like this, though on S4 Mark III you'll need to do your personal MIDI mapping, since FX sand controls do not come with factory mapping. To check and compare stamps quality of new stamps V3 to Serato, Recordbox, Virtual DJ, Algorithm DJ, and other software, check out comparison videos on this YouTube channel. That concludes an overview of Noah Stamps V3, the most advanced version 
of this incredible software yet. With its new algorithm, GPU acceleration support, revamped UI, powerful features, and improved workflow, Nullstamps V3 is a must-have tool for audio enthusiasts, DJs, and music producers. Upgrade now and experience the future of stamp separation. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.